master hunting guys Brian Miller and Benny Beekers are at the top of their game at Kia Vera Safaris and hunting methods are custom and tailor-made to individual guests' preferences and physical condition. A variety of hunting methods are used from spot stalking to blinds located at strategic points. Their focus is on mature trophies harvested during an unforgettable hunting experience. Experienced trackers and spotters will assist you on your hunt. Kervira Safaris is home to over 15 free roaming species of plains game, like black wildebeest, commonly known as the white gnu with its distinctive long white tail. And this is the species that the barbecue hunter has decided to hunt. They also have blessbuck, blue wildebeest, the diker, eland, gemsbuck or orange, red hartebeest, the fastest antelope of this region, impala, kudu and the ostrich, the world's biggest flightless bird. In the open plains, there are also springbok, warthog, and mountain zebra. The wild place hides offer a great viewing platform to spot animals hiding in the thicket or traveling to the open dry pans. With a lot of animals spotted during the hunt, none offer a shot, and with a beautiful Namibian sun setting, it's time to head back to the lodge, this time to cook up a storm the African barbecue hunter way. On the menu, kudu and oryx fillet steaks, marinated over a period of two days. A flat iron is heated upon an open fire and the animal fat is added. Now it's time to barbecue the piece of meat to perfection before honey and mustard dressing is added. Time for the feast. Kiaver Safari cuisine is delightful and their variety of local specialties are worth sampling. Namibian beef and mutton is also free from harmful residues, hormones and antibiotics and absolutely delicious. After a hearty breakfast, the barbecue hunter arrives at the spot where the walk and stalk for a trophy black wildebeest will start. The main rainy season occurs during the summer months of January and March. 
Rainfall is usually caused by a convection of thunderstorms that is unevenly spread throughout the country and normally of short duration. Namibia is one of the most arid countries in Africa, has a dry climate, typical of a semi-desert country. Humidity is very low, the water is mostly fine on open plants. This is normally where most animals are found, like this beautiful black wildebeest bull. Now the hunt is on. Black wildebeest, yeah, at Kierwede in, in Namibia, central region. We still need to go and see what the specimen looks like. See the cracks here, so it's a sign it's really a very old bull already. And uh, yeah, we will definitely make a nice trophy. I must admit, it's been a, a wonderful hunt here in Namibia with Kierweder and Benny Bierkes, the expert. He knew exactly where to come to find this fantastic bull, black wildebeest bull. And yeah, Benny, I think it's time to get this thing to the cool room and because this is, after all, barbecue hunters, so we need to see what cuts we can make yeah. and what we can put in the grill. Yeah, what it tastes like. And what it tastes like. I know it's going to be yeah. good. It's going to be tender. Yep. It's going to be awesome. Right, you're on the barbecue hunter next week. We'll see you in another part of the world. Let's see what's on the barbecue next week. Enjoy. <laughs> African Barbecue Hunter is proudly brought to you by RadressMedia.com, turning your hunt into a motion picture. Minox Optics, visible innovation. Musgrave Rifles, the legend is back. Next Wheel Gear and Reach Line of New Zealand by Wolverine, relentless by nature. And by Kirvia the Safaris, exquisite planes game hunting under the Southern Cross.